just about to get underway. And on the hill here today, Sandy Alcantara. What do you have on him, Chris? Try to stay back for that power changeup. Speed. Ah, oh, that hit him. Got him right there. And the leadoff man is aboard to start the inning. Well, he was right up on the plate, so even a small misfire was enough to send him to first. Now, here is Vladimir Guerrero. Wouldn't chase that time. With the go-ahead run at first, and we're just getting started here in the top of the first. And another ball. He might want to steal second in this spot, but he's dealing with a catcher that has one of the best pop times in the game. He needs to pick his spot very wisely. Alcantara over to first, and he's back safely. Base runner with a one-way lead right there. All he's trying to do is get a look at the pitcher's move. Had no intent of stealing on that pitch. Double play ball to second. Albies. Off balance beat. There's That's one. Out. And he's no, safe he's at good. first. That's their first hit of the ball game. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. now. Deal, Here comes deal. the pitch. Runner breaks for oh. second. There's a ball. Real Utah throws that in time. It's a stolen base. Well, a nice lead and a nice steal there to get in the scoring position with the heart of the order at the plate. That might just lead them to pitching around these hitters a little more because of the open base, but it's early in this ballgame. Can't imagine it'll change the attack plan too much. Man at second. And a count one and two. The pitch comes up empty as he chases that one in the dirt. Real Muto up with it. Fires oh. the first. Out on the drop third strike. Two gone. Here comes Freddie Freeman up to hit. And that one is lifted in the air. He dives, but he can't make the catch. And they strike first as they take a 1-0 lead. Fires the second too late, and he's got a double. Here's Harper now. Not even close there. Ball one. It started a little too early. Strike one. Double barreled action in the bullpen. Edwin Diaz getting ready to go. Alvarado warming up as well. Way out front for strike two. And he really sells the changeup with that arm action. Ground ball right side and foul ball. Two outs. Hits and misses. It's a strikeout. But a run will score in the inning on this RBI double. It's now bottom of the first. Here's the center fielder, Curtis Granderson. High fly ball, right field. This could go the distance. Home run. Fastball, you have to live on the edges and hit your spots. If you don't, you'll get hit hard. Really good swing there. Patient, waited for it. It was like BP all over again. And that's down. A base hit. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going oh, to the boy, opposite down. field, and it doesn't always translate into the game. But and there he goes. Oh. Ball misses. Real mutual throws, not in time. It's a stolen base. When you're trying to swipe a bag against an elite level arm behind the plate like this guy, you better get a great jump and hope that your speed can finish this job. That was a great jump right there. Really nice steal at second base. Fall off foul. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. And a pitch. Up the middle. 
in plenty oh. of time to first one gone bottom half of the first that's a good piece of hitting right there the job was to move the runner up and give your team a chance to score the go ahead run that's exactly what happens so you better believe your teammates are happy with you after that at bat yep, and that's that outside out. I think ultimately you want to tie him up get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield tied up here in the early going line drive pulls it in on the run runner tags from third led the play safe and they take the lead sometimes that can be a little tough to score on it was hit so hard that getting back to the bag the tag takes a little bit of time by the time that outfielder catches it but a really good job of getting that run in from third two out spaces empty Pitches in the dirt and a count one and two. Bows that off to the left and we'll do it again. Two down, nobody on. Bows it off, still one and two. The wide to kick the pitch. Fly ball down the line. And no one could get to it. It's a foul ball. Fights that one away, still one and two. Seven fouls in a row. Such an impressive at bat we're seeing right here, regardless of how it ends up. And yeah, that skips in the dirt. In the air, left field. Yellich should have it. He's got it. And that is that. So they get two runs on two hits. One of them left the yard. We go on to inning number two. The Singers out. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. His righty lefty splits there. And the right hander back to work. Ripped on a line. And an automatic double as it hops the fence. Manager at Craig Kimball comes on now. Pretty big spot he's coming into trying to strand that runner at second base. So he's going to need to make some quality pitches. He does have first open if he needs to use it. Christian Yelich swings through it for strike one. With the tying run at second, here at the top of the second. Strike two. No ball, two strikes. Bounced out to short. And no throw for some reason as he reaches first. That's got to be an error. Fernando Tatis Jr. to hit here. Swings and misses. That's strike one. Next offering is outside. And the righty deals. Swing and a miss. Now one and two. Now that right, the pitcher wants a ground ball double play opportunity here. You've got to lay off pitches down in the zone. Right there, swinging at that pitch, that's a no-no. Next offering way off the plate. Wouldn't chase that time. Jose Altuve up next. Waves at the bender for the strikeout. 
Good horizontal movement on that curveball right there, and just enough to get him to chase it. He placed it just off the corner, and that's one of those where a pitcher says if he's going to miss, he's going to miss off the plate. So really good job. Great pitch for the punch out. Pulls it down, and there's two gone. Left-hander out of the bullpen, Tanner Scott. Well, the best relievers love the opportunity to come in and protect the tight lead late in the ball game. Some of them are just wired different, so we'll see what he's got here. Turner at the plate and takes high there. First and second, two down. And fouled off. Have you ever caught a foul ball as a fan? Only as a broadcaster, not as a fan. You? I've been in many games as a fan. In the dirt, and the count's even at two. So both runners should be on the move here on the full count pitch. Yeah, this is a good chance to tie up this ball game. See if he can find some open grass in the outfield. Two outs. A couple of base runners at first and second. In there. Got him looking for the K. Big time third strike to end. Back now at Singer Stadium. And here is John Crook. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Here comes the skipper. Here comes Mark Melanson. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. He handles it himself. One up, one down. Ozzie Albies up to the plate. Ball one, no strikes. Albies in his seventh season, 27 years old, and he's a native of Curacao. That's down and in. Next pitch in for a strike. Two and two. One down, base is empty. Fouls it back with two strikes. And down on strikes. That's the second out. Two outs, base is empty. And the batter will be the shortstop, Francisco Lindor, down the line. And that will drop foul. Two outs. And a foul ball. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Sitting of work there as he sets him down. One, two, three. Oh, Billy Wagner on right. a pitch out of the pen yeah, here. And we all know about his slider. It's just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say. Spin rate's very high, and it just breaks a ton. As the lefty gets to work. And that one fouled off. Swing and a miss. 0 oh and 2. Big time jam right there. I hate it as a hitter, but standing in center field, you can't help but chuckle a little bit. Fights that one away, and the count remains 0 oh and 2. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Really tight bite on that slider and just couldn't get the barrel to it out front. You've got to try to pull those hands tight to the body to get it through. And I'm thinking he probably wanted that pitch to end up even more inside to keep it out of the danger zone. But it had enough late break and deception to get the job done. Here's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Crushed. Left center field. This one's deep. Forget it. was a hanger and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that and right there he made him pay Freddie Freeman up to the dish Ball. and That's a good eye there
Ball to strike. The pitch. And that one fouled off. Swings and misses, struck him out. With that kind of velocity and elevated fastball, even if it's still in the strike zone, can be tough for hitters to get on top of. Harper stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Way to lay off that fastball off right there. You're looking for something you see well that you can handle, but you also have to keep the discipline Whoa, so that you're down. not popping up pitches that are just a little too high. Two down, nobody on. And oh, another ball. JT Real Muto waiting for a turn at the plate. Let's see if he gives him anything to hit here. And yeah, there's ball four. One of the things about that two out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So if all down the line or into the gap will produce a two out RBI, and those are the best. That is, if you are the offensive side of it. Out in front and foul to the left side. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get into scoring position. A little tardy on that fastball. is going to have to get it going a little quicker. Get that front foot down. Three. Got him swinging for the K. Pulled the string of the changeup. One scores in the inning coming on this solo home. Back here with my pal Ziggy as we go to the last of the third. JT Real Muto steps in. Billy Wagner will take over here. He has a great slider with tons of movement. Trying to keep good speed off the bases. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Wow, short work to send him packing to start the inning and no messing around either. All three pitches were in the strike zone. Attack mode all the way. Given the pop he was dealing with at the plate. Granderson in the box now. Take strike no. one. Inside. That one drifts inside. High fly ball down the left field line. Nobody can get there, and it's a foul ball. This guy's got good power with one swing. He can win it for him. Definitely got the hitter conscious of the pitch inside. Really think oh, the outer man. half is open. And now two and two. Up the middle, into the outfield, base hit. And now the winning run is on base. A perfect example right there. That plate discipline runner on the goal. Swing, and this one's blasted. It's got a chance. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back. On the infield, got hey. to the spot, turned around, and made a nice catch. Guerrero in the box now, takes All strike right one. And it's one and one. This might be a steal situation, but that runner on the goal. Ah. Pitch in for a strike. One ball. Real mutual throws, not in time. It's a stolen base. Well, it really doesn't matter what the situation is. When a guy like this gets on first, you. Oh, and this one's blasted. High and deep. It's on its way. Out of here. Ball game. He powers that one out of here, and they walk it off for the win.